The USC football team is in turmoil right now. Head coach Steve Sarkeesian has been sidelined with an, indef an indefinite uh, leave of absence. CBS 2's Cara Finstrom is live at USC with a reaction to that decision. Cara? Well, there's no scheduled practice here on campus today, but we did catch up and speak with one football player who didn't want to go on camera. He says the team is just trying to stay focused. They're coming off a rough loss and getting ready to play rival Notre Dame. If the man can go get himself a little bit of help and figure his life out, I think that's the thing people, are, people should be concerned about first. A number of student athletes at USC told us they're worried about the well being of football coach Steve Sarkeesian. Athletic director Pat Hayden announced a gridiron shakeup yesterday after Sarkeesian failed to show up at a practice. I called Steve, talked to him. Uh, it was cl very clear to me that uh, he is not healthy. Uh, I asked him to take an indefinite leave of absence. Offensive coordinator Clay Helton is a man sitting next to Hayden. He'll fill in for now. Multiple sources told the Daily News Sarkeesian had gone to a pre-practice meeting smelling of alcohol. And back in August, Hayden had stern words when video surfaced of Sarkeesian at a pep rally cursing and slurring his words. Get ready to ride on, baby. Let's go. Sarkeesian quickly admitted he'd mixed prescription drugs with alcohol and said he'd undergo unspecified treatment. The way I acted was irresponsible. Since then, several other allegations have been published about Sarkeesian's alcohol use. The LA Times says it conducted a series of interviews suggesting alcohol use was an issue back when Sarkeesian led the University of Washington's football program. Now some are questioning why action wasn't taken sooner. There were a lot of players on that team who were starting to express concern because they started to see telltale signs of a head coach that was not being himself. Those that are younger that want to come to USC, they don't want to come when a coach comes to practice, I don't know, extra happy. In fact, one five-star recruit linebacker, Dalen Hayes, has just pulled his commitment to USC. Rick, Sharon, 